Hey guys, can't kind of just realize how dark it is. Well, it's darker even with my glasses on, which is annoying. I mean, I don't think opening the blinds is gonna help much, but let's try. Just kind of like an overcast day. I like how it always rains, well, not always. Most of the time it rains while I'm at work and then by the time I get off work, it's not raining. So that's usually kind of nice. <laughs> Anyways, so today was an interesting day. Just kind of got more info about the secret project I'm working on and I'm not going to say yes or no to people who are guessing who it is in the comments because there's already some guesses. Although I will say one thing, it's not Mark Crilly. I was wondering, I was like, I wonder if everyone's going to think it's Mark Crilly. It's not. So that's all I'm going to say and I'm not going to say yes or no to any other YouTubers. So yeah, but that's what I'll be working on a lot, a lot for this next month. So we'll see how the vlogs go in terms of exciting content. <laughs> also, at work, I got something. Because <laughs> I guess everyone got these on Friday, but I wasn't in on Friday. And so I missed their big fancy meeting and they everyone got donuts and stuff, I think. That's what one guy claimed. I said I couldn't tell if he was lying because he was lying before that. <laughs> anyway, so this is one of the pixies, but this is just kind of like the one of the generic background pixies. So he's not that exciting. These are the only plushies that were made. I kind of wish my boss picked one of the main characters to do instead of just the generic background pixie, but he's still super cute. This isn't quite how the 3D models are. They actually have flatter faces, but they're kind of like, they're supposed to be bumblebee sized, but they're actually a bit bigger and they're kind of like gremlins or something. There's an example of what the king pixie looks like. I posed that, by the way. <laughs> That's my work right there on that tag there, also on the inside. I also posed that as for a poster and I guess it got used on the tag too. Here's a little info about the pixies if you're curious. So I got a free plushie, he's so cute and he's really really soft. Also, okay, you know how I've been planning on leaving full screen and joining Frederator. All was going well, I even signed the Frederator contracts although it's not officially binding unless full screen releases me kind of thing but so I told full screen a month ago I was like because I had to give a one month notice I was like I'm not reading my contract here's why and they're like yeah okay and remind me a week in advance so a few days ago which is a week in advance I emailed them I was like just a reminder I'm leaving at the end of the month and the guy's like okay all right and he's like let me just uh tell my supervisor whoever whatever he called the guy and I was like okay then I get a reply back today and it's like, we know you want to leave, but we're going to give you this last minute offer. And I was like, oh my God, like, <laughs> I was not expecting that at all, but they're trying to get me to stay. And so they're like offering me all these things. And I was looking at it and I was like, what? Like it was an unbelievable deal. I can't even say the specifics of it, but they offered me a few different things. And I was just like, Frederator can't top that like you can't like they offered me the holy grail and more so it's like I don't know I was like I don't know what's gonna go on now I don't know I'm kind of in talks with both networks we'll see what happens but that kind of threw me for a loop today I was just like oh, 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 oh. so that's exciting and on a less exciting note I got a copyright claim on one of my videos, my Astrid braid. It says that I used someone's music and so I disputed it as you can see because I have a license to use that song through Audio Micro. They, at least they tagged the right song this time. Sometimes, like I haven't got one in a while. I think my last copyright claim was on my Elsa video because the song they claimed I used wasn't even the song I used. And I was like, you're an idiot, YouTube and your automated system. But this one is actually the song I used, but I have a license to use it. So it's like, so I disputed it and said all that and stuff. So hopefully that gets resolved. And that's pretty much it for my excitement for the day. I was like all hyped on YouTube stuff all day between like the whole network switching, am I doing it, am I or not? and the secret project and it was just like i was so hyper today and the day went by really fast surprisingly too i was like oh crap gotta get my work done 
so that's today so far so I'm just watching my pen pal unbox the stuff I got her so uh, people have been asking for me to upload the footage of me showing it but I think you could just watch her unbox it so I'll leave a link to her video in the video description if you want to see her unboxing what I got her apparently the first two minutes of Cora are uploaded online and so we're gonna watch it it's just two minutes, it'll be such a tease. Such a tease, but I need to see it. Looking for my drops on my meds. Wait, yeah, yeah, that's what I want. Okay guys, we got a serious problem on our hands. My, there's something wrong with the Montage Premiere Pro project file. And so the montage might not happen after all this time I've put into it. Um, I went to open the file today, because I opened Premiere Pro and it shows you a list of your most recent projects. And there it was, the montage project. It's there, it's been there this whole time. And so I go to open it and there was only two minutes of footage and it was a bunch of old clips that I've since removed from the montage and replaced with other clips. So it was like an older revision of it because I had over 15 minutes of clips and this was an old version of it with older clips and it was only two minutes of clips. So I was like, what the heck? Like, where's all the work I did in this last month? Like, I've been working like crazy on that thing. And the file is nowhere. I've like checked all my drives. And it's super easy. You just got to search for the file name. And there's nothing there. There's only old files. Even in like the autosave, there's only old files. And I'm like, well, what the heck? Because when I accidentally deleted my vlogs the other night, that was just the vlog videos. That's not where I save my Premiere Pro projects to. My projects are saved to my documents folder. And it's not a matter of unlinked files. Like if anyone knows Premiere Pro, if you move your original files around, when you open Premiere Pro, you won't find them. No, it's like actually an earlier, it's not like it says media offline. No, no, no. There's only like the first two months I think of footage there's like October footage and November footage and that's it <sighs> so <laughs> I don't have time to redo the montage so it might just not happen so <laughs> I'm sorry if anyone was like really looking forward to it we'll see how it goes montage might be forever gone and I'm not redoing it <laughs> it was way too much work so for some reason I thought I had October and November clips, but I actually I had clips up to October 22nd, so I've got a ways to go. But I think if I just make... By the way, I'm considering fixing the montage now. <sighs> I don't know. I'm kind of just thinking of maybe making a shorter version of the montage. Like, I have this spreadsheet. Like, half the trouble of doing the montage was... I was going through each and every vlog and writing out what happened in each vlog so I had to properly skim through each one but I was thinking like what if I just look through my spreadsheet try to find some memorable moments in there and just put those in and make like a shorter montage it's just really hard because I was going to finish that tonight and then work on Christian's picture tomorrow and then it's full force on my secret project as of October 1st so I might have to put Christian's thing on hold for one more day and see how much I can get done like it's already 10 o'clock right now so I'll have like a little bit of time tonight and then I'll have tomorrow and that's really my last chance to work on the montage so I don't know hopefully I can get something together I just feel like I don't want to give up like I put so much time into it and I do have that spreadsheet so I'll miss out on like random little moments but I'll see the spreadsheet see what happened and then I gotta like try to find where in the vlog that that happened but I think that will help me a lot and I don't know so right now I'm looking into it seeing if I'll potentially get a smaller montage done it's just so surreal because like that's what I've been putting all my time into <laughs> and then it's just suddenly gone but I mean, redoing it will be faster than it was initially doing it. I'm just sad I'll miss out on some moments that I had in the first one that I really wanted to keep. I'll probably miss out on some things, but that's okay, I guess. It's uh, better than nothing. So I guess I'll get cracking. Less talking, more working. All right, so 
I got done up to January 3rd. So I did like a little over two months worth, which is not bad because I've been going at this for like an hour. So I just kind of wish I got, I had just started on it earlier tonight. And, I mean, I had to first see if I could find my file, I suppose. That wasn't really wasted time, but I just kind of wish I got started on this earlier tonight and I could have got more done, but I was initially not thinking of redoing the montage. I was like, there's no way in hell I'm redoing this. But then I was like, you know what, let's just try. Let's just try. So it's coming along. And this spreadsheet is helping so much because usually if there was a little funny or goofy moment I wanted to include in the montage, most of the time I wrote down that moment in the notes on the spreadsheet. So that's really good. Um, it will slow down a little bit once I get to September because I haven't yet written notes for September. But that's all I'm going to be doing tomorrow, guys. I'm sorry. And my eyes are probably all goopy and nasty. Oh my goodness. Well, at least I found my motivation and I'm like, I will get this montage done. So, yeah. <laughs> oh dear, what is life? There's such high moments and such low moments and they can even be in the same day and you just, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, I suppose I will go to bed now. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm in this cute little park area, so I thought I'd stop and give an update. It was good. It was all good. Um, he said the inflammation's gone. He's going to keep me doing drops every hour for today and then tomorrow every two hours and so on. He kind of gave me like a little schedule. Although for my left eye, which is the good eye, I can just keep doing my normal eye drop schedule, but just 